Now, with the recent entries of so many international brands in uh, Myanmar, advertising expenditure there is growing by leaps and bounds. According to a local research firm, five years ago, advertising expenditure was worth just 24 million US dollars. Last year, it increased fivefold to some 118 million dollars. And by the end of this year, it's expected to be 180 million dollars. Observers told Channel News Asia's Myanmar correspondent May Wong that the expenditure increases will not just stop there. Basic, old school and unexciting. That's how many have described the advertising scene in Myanmar. But that's quickly changing with the creativity of foreign competition, which is in turn firing up the attempts of local companies in this fast-changing market. Renowned international brands like Coke and Unilever are the latest advertising game changers in Myanmar. In late 2010s, we don't need to... We are advertising because we want to be known. But now it's a need to engage with consumers to get your business. So for local companies, uh, for advertising, they need to be more creative, more innovative and more alive. Only then they can make a differentiation and only by differentiation they can make their market share more sustainable and gain some growth. Television advertisements currently take up the lion's share of the market, followed by newspapers. And it'll likely stay that way for some time to come. Television can reach the Myanmar consumer across the country because uh, the print media, like uh, the weekly newspaper or the daily newspaper, they still might have a limitation while television can reach the at least 80%, 90% for the national TV or at least in uh, the 20% uh, of the total population for the regional TV. But what about advertising on social media, which is now a central advertising platform for many companies in other parts of the world? Until last two years, Myanmar, the, the internet usage is very low. We can say like less than uh, 5%. Now reaching to around 15 to 20% because of the, the mobile phone penetration and also the internet, uh, the access rate. For the social media, uh, just picking up stage, actually. So usage coming up, for example, like uh, Facebook, compared to last two, two years, uh, the young people and uh, adults started using Facebook, but we still do not see too much of the advertisement putting on uh, the social media at this moment. Advertisements selling cars and financial products will also be the next growing trend in Myanmar as such products cater to consumers with rapidly growing spending power. With few media outlets in the past, companies have limited opportunities on where to advertise and how to market themselves. But that has since changed because the Myanmar government has liberalized the media sector, allowing for more newspapers as well as TV channels to operate. Now that means that companies will also now have to be more focused on where they want to advertise and who they want to target. So that means an ad that works in Yangon may not be suitable for those living around the other parts of the country because of different tastes, needs and lifestyles. Mei Wong, Channel News Asia, Yango.